we need to begin tonight by being quite serious for a moment and to acknowledge uh, that it has been a harrowing and at times bewildering week in this country, as you all know. Sligo, tonight we're thinking of everyone in Sligo. Sligo's hurting, and to, to be truthful about it, I think we're all hurting a little bit after what happened this week in this country, and I want to say that our sincerest sympathies, and I mean this tonight, go out to the friends and families of Aidan Moffat and Michael Snee, uh, but also to their neighbours uh, and to their communities, uh, people who loved them, where they lived in Sligo. It's a beautiful place. I've been there many, many times, and I can't imagine how they are tonight, but we're sending you all the love we can. But also to the members of the LGBTQ plus community across this island, uh, many of whom have been left traumatised by their deaths. And as you probably know, a number of vigils will be held across the country in the coming days, from Limerick to Cork and Waterford and Galway and Wexford. And there are full details of all of these on the Gay Community News website, that's gcn.ie. And I'd also like to mention that uh, books of condolence for Aidan Moffat and Michael Snee are open in Panty Bar's downstairs lounge in Dublin every evening from 4 to 10 p.m. over the long weekend until Monday, and that's where you can go to pay your respects. And beyond Sligo, given all the events of the week for anyone watching in tonight who perhaps, let's say, was on the verge of coming out and who now finds themselves terrified terrified into, into silence and into secrecy, it's important to know you're not alone. And I'd like to, if I can, talk to the younger members of our audience in particular. There is support and there is advice for lesbian and gay, bisexual, trans and queer young people in this country. Lots of support. We urge you to seek it out. Seek out what you need. It's all there. You deserve to be proud and you deserve to feel pride. And belongto.org is just one example of the many places you'll find support. So please go there. There is no place for homophobia in Irish society today. None. That's what so, so we want to... I mean that. So let's stand up together and, and be intolerant to it in all its forms.